traders welcome back to my youtube channel in this channel i post scalping videos and i post pure price action videos so in this uh, video i'm going to be talking about scalping so i'm going to be showing you one simple but powerful strategy in which you can catch some few candles in boom and crash please if you are new to this channel click on the subscribe button like the video share and you click on the notification bell so that whenever i post a new video you are going to get updated so in beginning we have to in uh, insert two simple indicators that our fractals and our awesome oscillator so in order to add these indicators you are going to click on the indicator icon which is which looks like f on the top of our screen when you click on it it's going to take you to where you find different indicators all right so we are going to start by inserting our awesome oscillator this is our awesome oscillator so when you click on it you are going to see the various uh options and you're going to do the setting as i said in the beginning of this video it's very simple but powerful the indicators that we are about to add they are not complicated they are very simple but they provide a lot of information all right so you click on the indicators you window you click on awesome oscillator you are simply going to choose our value up and our value down our value up or value down will be based on the color of our candlesticks all right if your candlesticks if your bullish candlesticks are green you, you choose green to be the value up if your bearish candlesticks are red like in my case you choose red to be the value down if they are white you choose white so whatever color that your candlesticks have been set you choose the colors here all right this is because when you do that it's going to help you in knowing when to take a sell or when to take a buy all right because the colors will change from time to time and they will indicate that this is going to be bullish this is going to be bearish all right so what you do is you simply choose on the pixel all right you choose one pixel in this situation okay here on the value up you choose uh green in my case and then the value down red because my candlesticks are green and red all right so when you do that you are going to find something like this in your chart all right you can see this is the green and the red candles all right so they reflect and they give information up here so just hold on i'm going to show you how to take trades based on this so let's go ahead and insert our fractals our fractals is uh one simple indicator too you are not going to do much you are just simply going to add the pixels and then for the levels we are not adding levels for now all right so you just add you you choose a color of your choice whatever color of your choice that you want you are going to click and then you click on done all right you can see these arrows these are fractals they indicate that there is going to be a temporary switch in direction all right you see that after a spike the fractals comes out and then it shows that there's going to be a potential shift all right so now how do we trade take trade based on this information how do we take trade based on these indicators that we have inserted we know that boom and crash are pairs that spike all right they have they in often spike once in a time so we are taking our trade based on the counter spikes so in a situation like this we wait for if the candle seeks to spike like in this situation boom 1000 you see that after a spike you see that the fractals pop out this black arrow it shows that after the spike price is going to move to the other direction okay so this was actually a setup that i missed so when that happened we wait for after the spike you see that we wait for the candle seek to start the the ticks to start forming down here you notice that when the price is in an uptrend the 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 awesome oscillator is still indicating green all right until when it start coming down it reach a particular point where this green turns to red like here exactly so you can see exactly at this point at this stick here it turns to red that is where we take our order 
all right so after the spike we are not entering immediately after the fractal pro uh indicates a change in in in, in, in direction we don't enter immediately we wait for these ticks down here to turn into red because in this case we are selling when it turns to red here we enter at uh, this candle so we enter our target is just to take few candles all right few candles and then we are out because you know that boom is uh is a pair that spikes you don't want to you don't want to get caught in a spike okay so you can see let me show you another example you can see that after in each spike you see that there's a fractal and you see how price uh moves down so i see that here that there was a spike you see that price it was indicating green here after the spike you see a, a, a fractal popped out and from here you see that the tick started forming but as soon as it reaches he, here exactly at this tick you see that the color changes down here in this awesome oscillator and it become red you see that if you enter here you take few candles three four two candles you are out all right so that is how it is you don't want to stay too long because you, you don't want to get caught up in a count in a spike there is the same situation you see that after a spike the fractal form out you see that you see that when it turns to red down here we enter at this candle you see that it's how accurate it is right so that is how it is if you are this is for boom because we'll be looking for cells in a boom so if we are going to crash for instance let's say crash 1000 in this situation you are going to see that uh at the spikes are downward so we'll be looking for buy setups so you can see here that you see that here price spikes down and down here it indicates rate is still indicating rate but we are waiting for the green candle to form when the green candle forms here we 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 we, we, we enter i mean the green tick forms down here you see that here there was still green that were formed but down at this point we still saw red so yeah we are waiting for the green to form at, at exactly at this candle this is where we take our buy order that is same here that is same here we wait after the spike down we waited we waited after the spike you see that we still have some red ticks here so we wait we enter exactly when we see this green candle form we enter a few candles we are out of the market so that is how simple and powerful the strategy is you don't want to stay too long in the market because you don't want to get caught in the counter spike like i said you don't want to wait because you have to uh bear a lot of risks if you stay long so you see that after the spike red spike the fractal the black line popped the a black arrow popped out and all of a sudden you wait we don't just enter immediately like i said you wait you wait you see that the this uh ticks are still indicating right here you wait as soon as it turns to green you take a buy order so you see how powerful it is you can go on and on i'll begin to show you more and more and more of them so that is how it is guys this is how simple and powerful it is as already i've already done the configuration you just need to uh, do same like mine so you see that here look at what is just happening here we are seeing a spike here okay we have seen a spike this is a a, a a setup that is coming up you see that the fractal you see the black arrow that just popped showing that from this spike there's going to be a change in direction but now we are not entering immediately we are waiting for this red ticks down here to turn into green so we will be entering around here now so you will not be far here we are going to enter you see that's how powerful the strategy is guys so that is how that is how the strategy is this is based on scalping all right so this is based on pure scalping and like i've said in the other videos that scalping is dangerous especially when you are scalping boom and crash so you, if you are not a risk taker no you don't have to consider scalping you know i've posted videos on pure price action in which you can trade with good risk management and you still make good profits all right if you know that you are not a risk taker you don't come to scalp boom and crash because you can place a trade and then you can win many trades you can win nine trades and the tenth trade you lose and the loss will be as a result of a spike that you got caught in 
and that will co cause you to uh, maybe be very devastating because you lose all of the profit that you make so that is how it is it is very rewarding but it is risky so it's good that when you are trading you should know exactly what you are trading all right so you should know how risky it is i know how rewarding it is so thank you for watching guys please if you are new to the channel subscribe click on the like button share and then click on the notification bell and from that see you in the next video